Welcome to Pinonic, and today we'll show you how we can estimate the velocity of hypersonic object in the atmosphere. So you see this video of the shooting rocket from the sky, and we can try to estimate the velocity of this rocket. Uh, so first of all, we need to download this video to analyze it. I already show you how to download video from YouTube, and now we will work with this video. So, you've got two options. Either you can calculate the distance between clouds and Earth and calculate the distance and time, but it's very difficult because you don't know the uh, heights of the clouds and you don't, you cannot estimate the time very exactly. But you can use Mach Cohn because it's ultrasonic rocket, you can calculate uh, Mach velocity by Mach Cohn. So first of all we download video and then we split it with command ffmpeg then input file is out our out and before and we will split it into uh, res files with the numbers done yeah? and let's have a look on them. So we will have a look which one is good. So this is good which is number 37 uh, this is good which is number 77 next one will be 116, and it's nice cone, you can see everything. Then we can find number 152. Then next one, next one. Uh, that's quite close. 196, and the last one is a 136. Yeah, so let's copy these files. 37, 77, 116, 152. 196 and 236. We will copy them in separate directory and remove all the rest of the file. Okay, this is our images. So we will analyze them. The description of all codes you can find in the links in the description of this video. And now we will use this code. So first of all we need to click on the right hand side of the cone. So let's do it. So we will click as many points on the right hand side of the cone, but we will not uh, take the cloud bit because the velocity can be different and it will be some optical illusion so we will take only real part and the left side of the cone click on the cone and press escape so you see this Mach number and angle but you should understand that this is a half of the angle not the full angle because for Mach cone we need to take half of the cone angle second cone so we will click on the right and left part of the cone it doesn't matter in which sequence you do so the Mach is about 2 here. Next cone, again the same procedure. You can click as many as you can. Uh, you can select as many dots on the cone, on the line as you like. Because more you select, the better line will be. How to approximate these dots with the line, you can find on the... I already published the video and you can find the description below. Okay, one more cone. So what it is. It is about so it is about Mach 2.3. You see, all of them are approximately the same around uh, between 2 and 3. So let's do next rocket. So this is Mach 2.5. And what is the final result? So let's see. After all images are processed, the final result is printed here. So the maximum velocity is 3. 3 Mach and minimal velocity is 1.96 Mach and average is 2.55 Mach. I would like to say that this rocket Reshnik have velocity about 2.5 Mach in the landing point, which is not hypersonic as it was declared. So this is only 2.5 Mach. That's it what we can find with this video with the Python code. If you like this video, please subscribe to my channel and wait for new interesting video. Thank you. Bye.